Hi, welcome back to the series of automotive cyber security sessions. I am Tota Krishna Hima, your cyber security expert. So in this video, we are going to talk about Tara methods. I'm just giving a list of methods like which we are using across the industry for threat analysis and risk assessment. So here are some of the tools like for the threat modeling. Mostly we are using stride across the world like that is stride approbation is spoofing tampering repudiation information disclosure denial of service elevation of privilege and a part of stride like we use octave that is operationally critical threat assert and vulnerability evaluation and attack trees are used similarly like the way we use fta's fault trees in safety also like we use htmm that is hybrid threat modeling method. So a part of these things, uh, we use Evita that is e-safety vehicle intrusion protected applications. Evita in combination with THROP that is threat and operability analysis. It is very similar to HAZOP in case of safety. And HEAVENS that is healing vulnerabilities to enhance software security and safety tvra that is threats vulnerabilities and risk of a system to be analyzed stpa security system theoretical process analysis you heard about this thing it as a part of sort of similarly like we use this thing for the security also like we have software vulnerability analysis for safety and security combination. So if you are implementing functional safety and cyber security together in your product, then you need to consider these tools like Sahara, security aware hazard and risk analysis method that is you which takes as an input like the source uh, is vulnerabilities and it is used to identify hazards. FMVEA that is failure mode and vulnerability effect analysis uses vulnerabilities to identify failures. Uh, the other thing is fact failure attack countermeasure graph. So this is a graph like which maps this is uh, a kind of traceability uh, graph. So which maps security artifacts and analysis with those of security with those of safety and includes countermeasures. And similarly, like we have discussed about STPA security, we have STPA safety security together. With this, I came to the end of the topic. Like if you like this video, please click on the like button. If you want to hear some more videos about automotive, cybersecurity, safety things, then subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you.